The Greek Orthodox Patriarch of Jerusalem, Theophilus III, arrived at the West Bank city of Bethlehem on January 6 to celebrate Christmas Eve according to the Julian calendar. Worshippers and pilgrims gathered outside the church, believed by Christians to be the birthplace of Jesus Christ, and enjoyed marching bands and a festive atmosphere while awaiting the Patriarch's arrival. Leaders from various churches arrive every year to begin their Christmas celebrations. At the same time, Orthodox Christians in Istanbul dived into the icy waters of the city's Golden Horn waterway for the ancient Greek custom of celebrating the Feast of Theophany, or Baptism of Jesus. Ecumenical Patriarch Bartholomew tossed a wooden cross into the chilly waters. It is believed to bring good luck for the year ahead to those who retrieve it. I am very good. On the I am very good. It is the fourth time that I have caught the cross here, 2016, 2017, 2018, 2020. Thank you, Happy New Year, and best wishes to everybody. Bulgarian men took part in a show of strength on January 6 by performing a dance in an icy river to mark theophany. Dressed in shirts decorated with traditional patterns, men in the town of Kalofer plunge into the freezing waters of the Tunja River in the annual Mushkohoro, or men's dance. Participants drink large quantities of wine in rakia to warm themselves up for the dance and receive blessings from an Orthodox priest to help them brace the cold. This tradition of strength and manhood draws people from all over Bulgaria because in the present time of the destruction of nations, people are looking for a symbolic place like Kalufur, the birthplace of our national hero, Christo Botev and his ancestors to give them strength and provide hope so that there can be a better future for Bulgaria. People are looking for their roots and they find them here in Kalofer. With these and many more celebrations taking place in the Orthodox world, the end of holidays is still a long way away.